Welcome to Math with Mr. J. In this video, I'm going to cover adjacent angles. And adjacent angles are two angles that have a common vertex and ray or side between them, and they cannot overlap. So we're going to go through four examples in order to better understand adjacent angles. Let's jump into number one, where we have angle X and angle Y and determine if they are adjacent angles. So angle X is right here and angle Y is right here. Now they do share a vertex. The vertex is where two sides or rays meet to create an angle. You can think of it like the corner. So angle X, the corner is right here and angle Y, the corner or vertex is right there as well. So they do share a vertex and then they also share this side or ray. So they meet um, the standards for adjacent angles. They have a common vertex and they have a common ray or side. So angles X and Y are adjacent. So let's move on to number two, where we're going to try to find two pairs of adjacent angles within those multiple angles. And we'll start with angle ABC. So ABC, so this angle right here. The vertex is at point B. Remember the vertex is where two rays or sides meet to create the angle. It's the corner you can think of it as. So angle DBC, this angle here would share that vertex and also share this side right here. So angles ABC and DBC would be adjacent. We can also look at angle DBE, this angle right here. It would also be adjacent to angle DBC because they share the vertex right here and then they also share this side or ray. So to recap number two, angles ABC and DBC are adjacent, and then also DBE and DBC are adjacent too. So let's move on to numbers three and four, where we're actually going to go through some examples of angles that are not considered adjacent angles. And this is going to help our overall understanding of adjacent angles. For number three, we're going to talk about the cannot overlap part of the definition of adjacent angles. And we'll start by taking a look at the same angle we started number two with, angle ABC. So this angle right here. Next, we're going to take a look at angle ABD. So ABD. You'll notice that those two angles do share a vertex and they do share a side, but they do overlap. Angle ABD overlaps ABC. Adjacent angles need to be next to each other, not on top of each other. So those two angles would not be considered adjacent because they overlap. Again, adjacent angles need to be next to each other, not on top of each other. And lastly, number four, we're going to take a look at angle ABC. So we'll start with that same angle again. And DBE, so this angle here. So those two angles do share a vertex, but they do not share a side or a ray. Remember, adjacent angles have to have a common vertex and ray or side. They have to have both. So those two angles would not be adjacent either. So there you have it, there's adjacent angles. I hope that helped. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, peace.